Adam, how you doing? Yep, it was not a good day for Jeff Sluman. Hoping to make the cut. This is his last trip to Oak Hill as a player. Of course, he's played a long, long time. And although his day did not go as expected, there was still a whole lot to see as he concluded his final round. The crowds at 18 were huge to see Sluman finish today. He had a pretty shot into this green that helped him set up a tap-in par to close a 10 over 80 his round today. Sluman certainly ended up with the worst of the weather draw today, too. Did not use that as an excuse, however. He did appreciate the reception he got on 18. It was great, you know, and uh, I didn't want to be limping up making a seven or anything like that, so I, it was nice to uh, have a little tap in four, and the stands were full, and uh, you look down the fairway, and both sides of the fairway are, are packed. Uh, it's, it's a, uh, Rochester loves their golf, and, and they always have shown it here. As for the guys who are in contention, interesting round today. Retief Goosen, pick him up on number 12, the short par four. Nice approach here, sets up a birdie. Goosen currently at two under par. Ken Tanagawa at 13. Downhill birdie putt, and boy, he reads this nicely, drops in for a birdie. He was leading for a little while, but right now he is two under. Both guys looking up at Esteban Toledo, your leader at four under right this second. The other big news today is about round three tee times tomorrow. They have been moved up. The first groups will go off at 7 a.m. The leaders a little after 9 o'clock. If there are no delays, the golf will be over around two, but that is a big, big if. Coming up at 6, we'll tell you about a Rochester guy who had a great homecoming this week as a caddy. That story in one hour. Live at Oak Hill, I'm Thad Brown. Adam, back to you. Thanks, Thad. Don't forget, you can watch the News 8 Senior PGA Digital Special Online Edition tonight. It starts at 7 p.m. at rochesterfirst.com. Look for it on the front page. Up next, what the Trump administration...